And guys, we are playing against Bayern Munich in the next episode. They are on the same amount of points as we are. And hopefully we will be able to go ahead and beat them. Hey, hey, assistant coach, how are you doing? It is me, Johnny Sports. Merry Christmas, guys. If we reach 800 likes on this video, I will post the second one today. And as you can see right here, we are going to be playing against Bayern Munich and Atletico Madrid in this very episode but guys if you need some ultimate team coins go ahead and check out the link in the description below and get your coins to get some team of the year players use the code Jani at checkout I am so excited to be back with another Bayer Leverkusen career mode. We are sitting in third place. Bayern Munich only on the same amount of points as we are. So if we win this game, we are going to be able to get past them and see what happens. Dortmund is still in first place. They are doing very well. But Thomas Müller is the guy I have to take care of the most because he is on top form so far. As you can see, this is our team. We are going to be playing with the best team possible except that I'm using Kramer instead of Sven Bender this time. I decided to go that way because Kramer wasn't getting any play time. But the game started right now. Belarabi now with the throw in to Lars Bender. It is now Haka and Chalanolu with the shot. What an amazing goal in the 11th minute already. What a strike from our Turkish center attacking midfielder playing in the center midfield right now because we changed our formation. But what a sick goal. And I will show the sliders at the end of the video if you are curious to see that one. But we didn't stop right there, Emma. NK with the pass to Hyung Min Sun 2 0 it is in the 20th minute already what the fuck is going on you might ask I don't know I was on top form yesterday when I recorded this episode what a start to shock the Bundesliga everyone is shocked about our performance so far in the first 20 minutes against Bayern Munich the best team or arguably the best team in the Bundesliga but it was Lewandowski's header that got them back into the game in the 50th minute what a nice header that was and now it was time to hold on to that one goal lead that we had Ribery on the ball now Müller Müller now once again to Ribery a good shot from him but that one goes wide very lucky for us MNEK now through in the 66th minute gets past the defender has some space but of course there is still Neuer to beat. And what was our goalkeeper doing? Nothing so far except throwing this ball to the opponent. Man, what the fuck? That was the worst mistake I could have ever made in this game because I wanted to pass it to Kramer who was on top but somehow the ball landed in front of Robin I think. But yeah, I messed it up. But it is the 19th minute. Belarabi with the pass to Sun. Sun is in the penalty area. Cuts inside. Looks for Hakan. Hakan with the shot. It gets deflected. The defenders mess it up. Hakan gets the chance to finish it once again. 3 2. 19th minute. What a nice goal from our Turkish player. Yes, fam. He is from my country. That's the reason I'm so good with this guy. That's a cheat. You know, when you're Turkish, you are playing much better with Turkish players. Yes. That's the cheat I'm using, guys. Sorry for cheating. I am so happy that we got the three important points against Bayern Munich. And I'm still amazed by the fact that we were able to win with such a nice goal that Hakan scored in first place. The first goal of the match. But now, guys, it was time to go ahead and beat Atletico Madrid. The team that is in first place in our Champions League group. So this game is very important for us. But they still do have Pogba. He is the one player I'm scared off every single time I'm playing against them because he is so sick in this game he is probably one of the best midfielders or better said the best center midfielder in this game now we are trying to get past the defenders we do so with Hyung Min Sun who hits the post and I've changed his instructions and since then Sun has been much better for me 24th minute Belarabi with the cross to Sven Bender who made it back into the team we are scoring in the 25th minute in the away game against Atletico Madrid but we wouldn't stop right there MNEK once again getting past the defender with his pace and also his strength once again skilling cuts inside takes the shot but Moya is saving that one 50th minute now Mansukic passing it to Suarez it is not the Suarez you think it is guys he wasn't able to score probably Luis Suarez would have scored that one but now Kramer on the ball looking for MNEK once again MNEK 
2-0 for Bayer Leverkusen. Who would have expected this scoring line in the second half, at the start of the second half? What a nice game for us so far. But Pogba had a big chance in the 56th minute. And then it was Castro on the ball. Castro to MNEK. MNEK looking to get past the defender. Does so. Pass it to Kramer. Great pass. Gets it back. Boom! What a nice goal from our team. 3-0 it is. MNEK with his second goal of the match. Look at the passing in this goal. What a nice way to go ahead and score a goal against Atletico Madrid. MNEK with the back heel and then Kramer with a perfectly placed pass over the top to MNEK. And yeah, I was just I was just owning Madrid, man. I wasn't expecting anything like this because I'm still playing on legendary, guys. And it's fucking insane what is happening in this game. Look at this passing right here. Hyung Min Sun getting past. Could get the fourth goal here. Decides to pass it to the one, the only one, MNEK, 4-0, gets his third goal in the Champions League match against Atletico, but of course, I couldn't have walked away from this with a clean sheet, how the fuck am I always conceding a goal, no matter what I do, I concede a goal, so that means in every single game, I have to at least score two goals to be able to go ahead and win a game, I, that is just ridiculous, but guys, 4-1 in the end, MNEK of course the man of the match, what an insane performance by our team and I feel much more comfortable when Kramer is playing, that's so weird, tell me in the comments down below what you think of Kramer and also guys go ahead and tell me in the comments down below what you got for Christmas, that would be very interesting. I personally got a new headset uh, from Bose, I don't know how to pronounce that in English, but it's uh, a German company as far as I know, and these headsets are amazing, that is not for gaming, it's to listen to some music, so I am very happy about that, but I'm also very happy about MNEK getting past the defender right here, but we're starting off this game against Hamburg, it started, let's go, it is Lazoga on the ball, Lazoga to Pratic, or Prato, I couldn't read his name but he took the first shot for Hamburg and then in the 28th minute we got a free kick and the beast was in the game Hakan Chalanolu 31 yards Hakan Chalanolu yes of course we are going to be scoring that free kick because it's so easy this year in FIFA 15 I've shown you guys in the tutorial I made how to score those and it is just so easy it doesn't matter on which difficulty you are playing the goalkeepers are retarded and right when I say it Mandanda with a horrible mistake I don't know what he was thinking he was doing but yeah we can see it it is 1-1 and Hamburg was the team to go ahead and try and get the second goal of the match as you can see I just couldn't do anything against it Behrami now getting through taking the shot and that one goes far we get very lucky right there and in the 66th minute I decided to go ahead and make some changes Bahluli, Tukulini and Vilalba are joining into the game now MNEK with a pass to Tukulini and then Behrami nearly scoring an own goal but we still had to go ahead and take a shot by ourselves. But before that, it was Hamburg on the attack once again. In the 77th minute, uh, that shot goes wide as well. So we got pretty lucky. Bender now with the pass to MNEK. MNEK getting past the defender with his pace in the 90th minute. But... We got unlucky. That one didn't go in. Would have been amazing to get a second 90th minute winner in this episode. But guys, we are now simming two games. Because these are not really the best games to play. Vilalba gets three goals in the cup against Augsburg. And guys, I've just decided that I will go ahead and put up a poll for you guys to go ahead and decide which player should play in the center defensive midfield position, Kramer or Sven Bender. Sven Bender is 81 rated, Kramer is 78 rated, but I somehow feel much better when Kramer is playing. It feels like my attacking is much better. So go ahead and tell me in the poll which player you think should play in the starting lineup. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode so far. It was very fun to go Go ahead and play those games and yeah smash that like button if we reach 800 likes by let's say 6 p.m today i will upload another video thank you guys so much for watching and enjoy your day peace